what's up everybody welcome back to the kitchen i'm gonna do something different man um i've been kind of reading some um stuff about people the balls that people use in bp and i want to talk about something that i learned from my good buddy pat phillips a long time ago when i was still ignorant to some of the balls i kept in my bucket first thing i'm going to say is the classic m is the worst ball to use bp with why is that that ball has a 40 core 325 pound compression the 40 the core st stands for coefficient of restitution what does that mean <laughs> well i have this little article up here um that i will put the link in this uh video what it means is that the value indicates how much energy is left after the ball strikes a movable object all right and then bounce it back at a speed lesser than its incoming speed so the 40 core what it means is when you bounce it on a pavement it's gonna it's gonna it's not gonna respond um as good as a ball with a high car core what does this mean for the bat this mean in order for this ball to perform this classic end ball this ball is gonna compress the bat a lot more just so that you could get that performance that's why they say these balls will harm your bat more than a 44 this ball will harm your bat more than a stadium ball now on the on the flip side you have the 52 300 ball okay they recommend using these balls for you know bp they use it in um usa softball whatever a 52 core ball is going to be a lot more springier when they hit the pavement as it came up compared to the 40 core see how dense that was you know so now this ball is going to have less impact off the bat all right which will save your bat it wouldn't fly as far but this will save your bat a lot more it's not going to compress the bat as much um for you guys out there if you want to be safer the 44 375 um has been these balls yeah they do make an impact on your bat but they don't hurt your bat as much as the 40 core because they have that a little bit more springiness coupled with a with a higher compression is going to perform a lot better so i'm gonna go ahead see that not a lot of impact here's the classic m again all right that means this ball is going to be a lot more springier now in comparison <clears throat> i know we got you juggling balls alan juggling balls, juggling balls. <laughs> this is a stadium ball stadium balls are defined as a 47 450 okay will they break your bat good every ball will break your bat but with a 47 core it's gonna it's gonna come off it's, it, the, the 450 makes the ball a lot stiffer it's gonna come off a lot quicker off the bat the exit speed is gonna be you know tremendous you're gonna hear that so keep in mind when selecting your balls for bp the best advice i can give hit a 44 375 it'll give you a nice simulate simulated feel a lot of people a lot of tournaments that's the ball they use the 44 375 the 44 400 I know in leagues they use the 52s, the 52 with a 370, the 52 300 or the 52 275 will probably be the safest ball for your bat. Again, it's a solid, comes right up, right? And the stadium balls, if I won't recommend hitting too many stadiums. If you want to go out there in a baseball field and have some fun or whatever, man, hit that thing, man. Let's see what it sounds like. That's gonna be a fun ball. So I'll leave the link with everything that we just talked about. Um, you know, guys, do your research, man. Again, you know, this is just a short video just explaining the differences with ball and the impact it make on the bat. If you're out there, oh, one more thing I forgot to say. When it's cold, yes, it do affect the balls as well. So, especially these. A lot of people will say, when it's cold, a classic him hits like a stadium. Yes, it do. But that means it is going to be a bat breaker. Okay, so yeah, they are fun to hit when it's cold. We just know that you're doing a lot of damage because that ball is going to compress the bat a lot more just to get it to perform. I will leave the article that we went ahead and researched for you guys to read up on in the description. Like I said, man, we're just doing everything softball related, just providing some knowledge. I know a lot of people was like, hey, man, I bought a bat, put like 200 swing with classic games, and the bat broke. Well, nowadays companies are not making. Uh, you know bats for classic m's you know they make it bats designed for pro m's you know and 52s 
believe it or not, U Trip does have a 52 out there if you could find it. I think it's called a Classic Plus. Yes. You know, so if you could find that, that would be something good that you could use as well. I think that's like a 52, 275 or something like that as well. Dudley makes a really good one with a composite cover. Yes. You know, so I think the hardcore is a good ball as well. As always, man, for the guys in the kitchen, man, I hope you find this information useful. Appreciate you guys coming in. Click like, subscribe. Peace. Oh.